Welcome to Honey of Knowledge. In this video, I will tell you my experience of appearing for IG Ideas Master in Economics interview process. So it all started with me deliberating upon whether I should appear for that interview or not because I had already qualified for CMI's data science program and I had made up my mind that either I will join the CMI's data science program or I also had an ISI MSQE interview call. So I would either get into ISI MSQE if my interview process goes through there or I will get into CMI's data science program. But after a bit of thought, I came to the conclusion that in a previous year, I had missed the IGIDR interview cutoff by 0.6 marks. So I thought that maybe this time, I have, if I have not missed that interview cutoff, I should get that experience because any interview experience is not going to take anything away. It will generally teach me something about myself. So I went ahead with their interview process. As I was already living in Mumbai, I did not have that much of a hassle there. I just took an Ola and uh, went to their campus. It was roughly around uh, 30 minutes of ride to the campus. After I reached there, all of us were asked to get seated in an auditorium. Now in that auditorium, there were, I would say roughly around 100 odd people. Now, I don't remember the exact count, but this is what my estimate says. Now, now obviously the people were all across from India. So you had a good understanding of which people are going to get selected to ISI and they're going to leave their uh, IGIDR calls. So when they leave their IGIDR calls, you will get an admission offer from IGIDR if you're in the wait list. So this were, these were the conversations going on there. Plus people were coming from their interview. They were sharing their questions and largely I was kind of wanting to get done with that process because uh, I had reached there quite early in the morning and my interview was not happening for a long amount of time. So I just wanted to get that thing done. Now my turn came very late in the evening, somewhere around four or five. I mean, I'm saying it late because I reached there quite early in the morning, eight or nine. Now, when I entered the interview room, there were like seven to eight people. They were all sitting in a semicircular position. Now they started asking me questions. The first question, which I remember as of now is they asked me, about myself, which was a pretty standard question. And I gave them a well-prepared answer. After that, they asked me that why I want to do masters in economics, not PhD, because I was already touching 30, not exactly 30, but I was more than 29.5. So they asked me that, why don't you do a PhD? To which I replied that I want to first understand the curriculum of economics, get an interest in economics and then understand which area in economics is something which I would like to devote my research on. But they were of the frame of the mind that even PhD course has a kind of coursework. So you can discover that in the coursework. But yes, the conversation went like that. They were trying to sell me the idea that I should do a PhD rather than a master's. And I was trying to give them arguments as to why I do not want to do a PhD, but a master's in economics. Then the conversation went ahead. Now I was asked few questions on economics. Now the questions were mainly in macro uh, because uh, the professor who started asking me probably must be in macro. So uh, she asked me about economic cycles, about recession, about uh, uh, what happens when we have recession, how can we get out of recession, uh, quite a lot of macro questions on recession and economic cycles. Now, after that, uh, I was asked, what is my preference? I mean, which I like, micro, macro, or maths. So uh, I did a wise thing that I said that I'm indifferent. Uh, because I did not want to choose a topic and then if the question is difficult, not able to answer it. Rather, I will just throw back that choice to the person who is taking my interview and if he gives a question which I am not able to answer, he would have a probabilistic point of view that probably he would know something else other than what I have asked him. So I would rather give that decision to him. So I gave that decision to him and he gave me a utility question 
and ask me to solve it on the board now that question was not that difficult but i don't really understand that what happened at that point of time that i was not able to get the answer to that question it was something related to utility maximization and things like that uh, utility maximization and uh, something like that which i don't remember I remember remember very vaguely that it was not a very simple utility question also but it was not very challenging also so i was not able to solve it then uh, the interview asked me that i can have a seat then we again had a similar conversation about what i like in economics and why do i want to do a masters and uh, how i will uh, see myself in the coming years so the questions were not really technical in nature they were more about my profile probably because the career trajectory which i have taken so what my understanding of uh, this process is that i also talked to a lot of people about their interview experiences who were sitting around me they said that if somebody says that they like econometrics they grill the person with econometrics questions and trust me econometrics is not something which you should say as your interest because at an undergraduate level you do not get that much exposure to econometrics and any professor will ask you hundreds of questions which you will not be able to answer so i would say a safe bet would be choosing microeconomics and if you are good with macro then choose macro or even maths for that matter but don't try to choose econometrics because you may get fooled into that trap so uh, this was my experience about igidr interview process and uh, yes i did not give that much of effort so i don't have that much of recollection also because i already had a cmi admit i kind of wanted to get into isi so this was it